Hello Aries, welcome. I'm Ryan, thank you for being here. This is going to be a general reading for you may be dealing with. Of course, everything may not resonate, so take what it does and leave the rest. And for more tarot readings after this, please check out my wife's channel, about to be three tarot, which is read for you as well. Thank you. See what's going on. Aries, 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 who are you dealing with? Um, I kind of feel like I have to give you a heads up or a warning on this. Heads up, uh, keep your eyes peeled because what I'm looking at or who I'm looking at, I don't know where they're going or what they're thinking, but they, they're showing up emotionally speaking like a bat out of hell. Um, there's something here emotionally that they are just refusing to kind of deal with face and confront and heal from and ultimately they're they're moving forward with this type of d determination of i know exactly what i'm doing i know exactly how i feel i know that i'm holding on to this grid this grudge i know i'm in you know very resentful um goodness There may be some sort of consideration of communication here between the two of you. I don't exactly know. I kind of feel like either one, they're going to try and handle this on their own or take care of this on their own. Or two, they may bring it up to you. I don't know. But either either way, they decide to handle this. Um, it seems like they have no other choice or option but to let it go. At the same time, they are not letting it go. They, they, they know that there's nothing they can kind of do or say really too much to kind of change things as is. I kind of feel like that they're just holding this grudge about something. But moving forward from this, they're in this energy as to being definitely on the fence, what they truly want to do. Um... They're definitely planted, but they're not doing much. They don't want to do much. It's like they don't even want to give to their own situation, their own circumstances. It's like they're they're refusing to do anything at this point. It's like they're, they're willing to do some certain things, but not everything. And it's because they are pissy, to say the least. Very pissy. Huh, interesting. That's interesting. It's like they're they're willing to find out where everything is leading and where everything is going, what everything's kind of like amounting to. Um which is fascinating because it almost seems and feels like even though they are showing up in this very pissy mindset and perspective they are becoming aware of something here that kind of like snaps them out of it. It's like, hey, dude, it's like, were they seeing red? It's, it's not even energy of were they seeing red. It's an energy of um, emotionally, it's like, hey, you okay? I think they're having the realization of like, oh, to this extent or this extreme of emotional energy that they're feeling internally, they're having the realization of like, oh, I do have this much emotion. It's like, kind of like saying love will make you do some wild things. Love will make you do some irrational things. And say some crazy shit. That's if, of course, this is regarding love, but we'll see. <laughs> their, their, their mind, their mind, and their emotions are going back and forth. It's like they're, they're clearly not on the same page with themselves here. Their mind's telling them one thing, their emotions are telling them another, but then their emotions are also telling them two contradicting things at the same time, and it's because their mind is getting in the way. Um, they feel they feel something here, 
but because their mind is stepping in, um, it's kind of like people having a conversation with themselves. Like, well, what about this? Well, what about that? Well, what about that? And they feel one way and then after sitting in their mind or their thoughts about this a little bit longer, then everything begins to kind of shift and change their perspective. And it's like, it's them doing it to themselves. It's like they're, they're flipping through their mental lenses, which is changing how they're feeling emotionally speaking. So in this case, their, their emotions are dependent on what they think, how they perceive. But ultimately, as they're trying to address their thoughts and their emotions, they still, they're like, well, it, it sort of makes sense. And so they're trying to kind of like make sense out of their own internal world or universe. It's like, but they're only gaining certain bits and moments of clarity and not everything. They're, they're not getting the full story. They're not, they're not, they're not seeing the full story. Even though they kind of, they're having certain realizations, they're not seeing the full story. They're understanding certain specifics and details about it, but Ooh. okay. Well, there is, like I said, there is something going on between the two of you. If you guys aren't in talk, if you guys aren't talking or in communication right now, um, you're about to be. You're about to be. And this is nice because overall, with this this gaining of certain amounts of clarity. Um, it's kind of like follow the yellow brick road. What will they discover on the way to you? <laughs> um, they're having to decide to move forward with things as is, even though they're a little here, they're a little there. Um, they're trying to figure out if something can take place with the two of you. They are. I, it seems and feels like they're finally and slowly beginning to open up to you. Um, at the same time, it's not in the greatest energy as to how you guys are progressing and moving forward together. Like you guys are slowly getting on the same page at the same time. Like, it's like, are you are you guys there yet? You're not there yet. What's gonna happen? I feel like they want to make the best out of it. I, I do. I feel like they want to make the best out of it. This is, how do I say this? This is complicated to say the least. It's like, what's your relationship status with Aries? Complicated. Complicated. Because even though, geez, even though they want to make the best out of this, it's like, um, they're battling themselves at the same time, ultimately. They're battling themselves. And I don't, I'm not quite 100% understanding that or following here. It's almost like they're, they're pursuing a different time space with you, but they're also in resistance or conflicted about the present with you. And that's what I find fascinating. They're kind of like, we'll make the best of it. And it's kind of like, well, where are you at? Mentally and emotionally, where are you at? Um, I, I myself, I'm not too sure where they're at. I, I do see that they are trying to figure out things with you at the same time. It's like, It's like, okay, we're having fun now, but emotionally and mentally, you're someplace else. I don't know. But of course, if you are dealing with anyone, you could be dealing with an air sign, an earth sign, or a water sign. Goodbye.